Hello everybody, Slim Kirby here. Welcome back to more of the Mario Golf Advanced Tour playthrough. Last time we uh, completed um, the doubles matchup against uh, Joe and Putz. We've officially uh, showcased that we're the dominant duo and I'm the dominant player of uh, the entire Marion Club. And because of that, we're actually going to leave today. So that sounds like a good idea to me. Um, before we do though, just want to kind of very quickly show this off. Just gonna save the data and leave. And yeah, if you go to Quick Game, um, essentially this is where you can uh, play free mode. Just play any of the games in this uh, title. And you can actually play as these four Mario characters. You can play as uh, you know your two characters, or you can play as the other characters that you can unlock as well. And they actually have their own stats too, which is kind of neat. Um, wow, it's like. It, it, these guys don't really have, like, very long drives. I think it's only because, like, I think you can unlock star variants for these characters. And when you do, they'll have, like, better stats. So that's probably why, technically, we can drive further than all these characters right now. Um, but yeah, just felt like showing that off really quick since we know we, we did unlock that last time. But let's actually go back into the story. Um, like I said before, we are actually going to be leaving the Marion Club. Uh, before we do, though, uh, I am going to do one thing. We're actually going to go... I think we can take on the um, the second drive distance for this. Yes. So if we do this, we can choose... Um, this one. Oh, still not quite there though. I mean, I, I can I can use this, but I'd have to like. Have to use super backspin to make sure I stay on there. I mean, I can do this. I was definitely hoping for a little more drive distance though, admittedly. And as you might expect, if we want to do the last one, we will need to definitely really increase our drive a bit there there are there are and will be ways to do that though more than just like leveling up because as you know that we also got that strength drink strength drink okay. i think i said that properly we got that from uh, helping out that koopa and that one um side game i guess there'll be other opportunities where we can get stuff like that too so That'll be in something else we can utilize as well. But yeah, see, we, we, we're getting this no problem. Um, hopefully not having backspin won't mess that up. Damn it. Rude. Well, we're not going to get the best experience from this, but... That's only the first time we screwed up, so we still have... Plenty of shots to work with that we can at least complete this. As usual, 7 out of 10. That's all you need. See, it's really annoying that we actually, like, missed it by that much. Because, like, it, if I would have gotten any, any form of backspin, that would have stayed in there. But Because it's like, no, let's eat your input. It's like, okay, nope, you're not getting that. Okay, well there is number seven, so we completed the challenge. Just need to do these two shots really quick. And then we should be good. And then we'll actually leave the Marion Club. <laughs> it's like, Slim, you've been talking about leaving for so long. Why have you not done it yet? So, hey, it's more complicated than that. Oh, I, I hit the fast fairway, so that kind of bounced me forward more. That's still enough to win, though. Complete. Uh, 60 experience. Yep, I'll give enough to level you up. I'll give you the scraps. Um, yeah, let's get a little bit more impact and control there. I can't believe it. You passed the best position. Yep. We did that before. 
But yeah, there there are more. There is one more stage we can do, but we're definitely going to come back for that later. Probably when I have about like a 240 drive, that should be enough. I hope. I think maybe. But yeah, we're we're finally going to leave. Um also in between this video and the next video, I might actually um, do what I said I was going to do and try to get those scores better, which means I might have some more level ups and experience for my characters, but I'll talk about and showcase what I happen when I do that. Um, but yeah, let's actually explore the map. Um, the Palms course, I believe, is right up here. But uh, before we do, as you can see, there's a lot of other like random practice greens in different places. These are basically just like additional side games says here, opening soon, Next Gen Epoch Golf Mini Park. So we can't do that yet, but that could be something we can do later. Uh, here we have, the greens may be huge, but you can only use one club. Go for the Miracle Hole-in-One. Let's see what this is. The One Club Challenge. Distance? I'll give you distance. When I was young, I could hit stick shots with a four iron. If you want to be a top golfer, try hitting stick shots from all the different tees. It's tough. You'll have to use the same club for the entire challenge. Still want to try? Yes. Hmm, maybe you're the real deal. Oh, so there's actually three levels of this, too. Um, so yeah, you have to basically do this. Um, it's a pretty basic challenge. Kind of the same idea that all the other side games are. I might have to... Yeah, I'm definitely going to want to If I'm going to use a 5-iron, I'll definitely need to use um, backspin, probably. Just to get up there. That was a pretty shot. I don't think you have to do like seven of these like you had to in other ones. I think it's just like you do this until you fail or something. Um, that should be good enough. You are going to be hitting downhill though, which is a little scary, but should be good enough. Yep, there we go. Complete. Get 80 experience for this. That's a lot of experience. Okay. I'm just going to put that all on the U. Hey, that was excellent work. You know what you're doing. Oh, so we have to leave and come back if you want to try the other difficulty. Now, I think for the harder difficulties... Yeah, I think the, the area gets smaller... So, we have a little more we can work with here. Um, let me see how this goes. Now, the, the easy thing about this is, like, you can at the very least, like, use this challenge to kind of, like, get an idea for the... Um, the type of power and stuff you have to use. So, like, right there, I hit max power. That obviously went too far. So, I'll do it again, and this time do backspin, and that should be enough to do it. So, or not. Like, what the hell? Um, how did that not work? Was there, like, a difference in wind or something? It may have been. No, there's no wind. Okay, I have no idea what happened there. How is that bouncing so much harder? Whoops. I 
I'm just surprised that backspin versus like just normal spin changed it that much. Well, in that case, I guess the strat here is just hit like less hard. <laughs> I guess that's the strat here. And I'm still hitting it over. Wow. Okay, this might take a little bit, so I'll just kind of cut till my successful attempt, I guess. Okay, I am still at this. I've been doing this for a really long time, and I've not been happy. This has not been a pleasant experience, but I'm still trying for it. I know I can do this. It's just I keep getting really unlucky with some of my shots here. But as you can see, I actually clubbed up to the 4-iron. I've been having a little more consistent luck with this. Which has been nice. Also, yay, chip shot. <laughs> Shame that's going to mean nothing if I don't clear this on this attempt. But still, it's still nice. Uh, but yeah, with uh, the 4-iron, I find that if you use super backspin with it, you can actually hit some pretty close shots. And then the backspin will pretty much kill it completely, like kill any remaining things. And the problem I've been having is mostly with this hole, because this one will, like, if you don't get backspin on it, it's going to go all the way down. Like, all the way down the hill, you're going to miss the cup. Which makes it really, really hard. So hopefully this will work. Thank you. Okay, one more. Oh, 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 no, that is it. Okay, there's only four. I thought there were five for some reason. Okay, we got it. And we get 150 experience, which is great. Um, honestly, I kind of like feeling like giving you a whole other level up, but Ella's pretty far behind. Let's give her just enough, and then we'll give you this. And we're going to get a lot from the next course, too, if we do the hard one. So, um, let's see. Um, yeah, I increased that last time. If this increases again, I'll probably try to doctor it a little bit. But let's keep going for drive distance here. And Ella... Yeah, you're... I need to give you some impact and control, girl. I know we're not golfing with you yet, but still, better to have that up there. So yeah, we have one more course we have to do. Oh man, this is going to be brutal. Because <laughs> you, know you know the circle's going to get even even smaller now but as long as we keep use the same strategies that we used before it shouldn't be that bad but yeah you pretty much have to get like right in there um let's see Ugh. I honestly think if I didn't hit the pin, that would have actually been better. Oops. Normally hitting the pin is not really a bad thing, but here it's like, uh, nope, <laughs> not so much. Okay, let's try this again. Okay, no, let's not do that. Yeah, I'm going to really need to control this. This is going to be not good. Because now I'm in a position where I kind of need to... Mitigate my distance a little bit, too. See, I think that's not going to be hard enough. Good attempt, but nope. Okay, well, let's try this again. Okay, I think I'm slowly finding the right thing to do. So for, yeah, for this first one you want to do 6 iron. And aim it about there to get it up there. I'm essentially just trying to run it up to like a lot of these places. And not trying to use backspin, because backspin's been killing a lot of my shots lately. So there's that one. 
This one is tricky. That might be good enough. Stop. Okay, one more. One frickin' more. Also the wind, too. Come on, please. Let this be over. Let this be over. Yes! I got it! Oh, thank God. <laughs> this was a rough one. I don't even know where I am in video time right now, because I've just been doing this for so long. That's going to give you a lot of experience. A lot of really good experience. I'm going to put just two full level ups into my character. I'll give Ella a level up to and I'll just put the rest into you. Okay, so definitely increasing this again. Um, definitely fixing this, because I don't want to have too straight of a shot. But yeah, there we go. As far as Ella, her impact and control's not doing too bad. She's kind of getting the fade a little bit, but... That's not really concerning me too much, so I'll just give her some more distance. There we go! Hey, that was excellent work. You know what you're doing. Psst, don't tell the old fella, but here's a gift for playing so well. Yo, what's that? Got a custom ticket A. We'll find out more about those tickets later, but, um... Actually, maybe we can deal with them now. I honestly don't know. Let's let's see what this is. Custom. Okay, this is where you use them. Oh, well, there's a, another custom tucket there. <laughs> so yeah, if we talk to this guy, whoa, you got yourself a custom ticket. Nice. Give me that, and I'll make you a six set of custom clubs. How about it? Sure. Cool. What kind of clubs do you want? So you can actually um, get different kinds of club types here. Clubs with increased distance, clubs with low trajectory, clubs that improve your swing, clubs with a big sweet spot, and clubs that increase your control. Um, I'll go ahead and get the POW clubs because those will increase my drive distance. Great choice. I'll make them right now. Grab a seat and watch me do my thing. I've been working on the golf clubs all the live long day. Ta-da, your very own brand new custom-made POW clubs. You want to do some club swapping right now? Sure. Swap them out. Okay, I'll just keep the clubs you're not using here. Just come holler me whenever you need them. So I believe... Um, yeah, you can actually get all of these if you have enough tickets. So let me also... I'll get the control clubs too. But I'm going to definitely try the POW clubs because that'll give me some distance. So there we go. Those are the control clubs. And if you want them back, like, you just come and get the ones, honestly. And you can actually see how they um, affect you, basically. Oh, and you can actually use, like, different types for each of these. So one thing you could do is you could use your woods and, like, we basically get 20 yards from them. And then we can use control for these, which increase the control for our iron shots. And then I'll probably keep control for wedge too. So yeah, it's kind of cool how you can like, kind of like mix and match in different ways. Of course, this will kind of do some stuff to your stats too. So keep that in mind. But yeah, that's basically, um, hold on. Is it, okay. I didn't actually confirm what I wanted to do there. Um, there we go. I just want to make sure that I'm do Okay, yeah. Okay, so yeah, you can do that. So it is important to show that off. 
Um, again, I really wish I knew what my video time was at after all that cutting I'm likely going to have to do. But um, we can't do this here. The cuckoo course is temporarily closed. We do have this course, though. Trouble golfers, enroll here to get your game analyzed and fixed. Okay. So this is the golf clinic. The pros that teach here are really popular in the golf world. If you want advice, go stand at one of the open tee boxes. Say, so trust me, if you want to get great the pros, check your swing. Your distance is better, but you're still drawing the ball a bit. Your trajectory is high, too. High winds will give you problems. Let's see. Can I move, or do I have to... Do I just swing? Oh, okay, here you go. I was like... <laughs> That's what you gotta do. So yeah, let's actually see. See, now we can drive up to 270 yards. Which is a pretty monstrous shot. Now, I don't think you actually get anything for doing this. I think it's just a kind of way to analyze your shot currently. You'll never nail tight landings if your ball turns on impact. You should probably avoid trying to hit in the sketchy air. Sorry, but we can't analyze mid- WHAT?! Um, excuse me, I don't think that was a missed shot. Oh, maybe you have to, like, get perfect or something. Maybe that's what they mean by missed shot. I was like, hello, I hit it, like, 280 yards into a fairway. Oh, no spin shots either? God, this clinic is kind of dumb. <laughs> no? What do you mean by missed shot? <laughs> I mean, I'm guessing they just mean shots that don't like have good accuracy or something. That would be my guess. <sighs> I don't get it. I'm sorry that I, d I got the deal with input delay or whatever, but like, you can at least be a little more fair and understanding about it. Well, analyze your frickin' missed shots. The second you have miss a shot briefly with accuracy, I'm gonna, you're gonna hear about it. See, that was a nice shot. Come on. See, that was beautiful. There's a green right there. Literally right in front of me. There we go. That's advanced amateur distance. You've got a nice straight shot. Your trajectory is kind of high. Your impact zone is quite big. Your control is pretty good. Your spin power is quite weak. You still need a bit more distance there. That shot is perfect. Wind affects your shot a bit. Your impact timing is slow. Your ball takes a tiny turn. Your stopping spin is quite bad. Well, you guys suck. That how about that? You know, like that's that's my opinion anyway. Okay, well, I'm going to go ahead and leave it at that. Um there are more things that can probably crap. I did not want to find that. <laughs> so yeah, that's a kind of what I mentioned before about like you can find like items in the wild. So we have a one-up mushroom which we can pretty much give to one of our characters to give him a free level up. Which is not ideal, because I feel like you want to find these later on when it's harder to level up, but... Whatever. It's too late. We've already, The damage has already been done. Uh, so we have power clubs. Let's focus on getting our impact and control back to normal. Tree. Okay, whatever. But yeah, there's... 
other things we can take a look at, but there's like some things that are closed right now. But we'll find like other things to do as we go throughout the game. Looks like club slots is open, and this is open too, but again, we'll check out these games later. Um, I'm going to go ahead and stop here though. Um, like I said before, in between this video and the next video, I'm going to do a little bit of grinding um, just to get like the best scores in the Marion Club. So I might be like one or two levels higher with some of my characters, but I'll, I'll let you guys, I'll show you guys the characters at the start of the next video just to compensate for that. And then uh, I guess we'll move on to the um, Palms course. I think what I'm going to do is I might do the tournaments first, then in between the tournaments and the match plays I'll do like the side games, and then I'll do the match plays just so, you know, we're not having like you know, back to back to back to back the same course over and over and over again. That's probably the best way to do this. Um, but yeah, uh, thank you guys for watching, and I will uh, see you guys next time. Later, folks.